Yeah. Hello everybody. So today I will uh, uh, guide the way we will uh, want to generate a CSV file uh, by Java code. Okay, let's start. Firstly, I uh, and I want to talk the final result will be like this. We will have the file with a uh, content with a header uh, with the code name and description and with the two items for the body content okay so firstly we need to create fit, uh, the uh, the header with the list a string we have the header okay uh, Array list, okay, and then we add a header. We will add the code header uh, the name and the final the reduction. I uh, sorry, it's corruption. Okay. Okay. Now let's create uh, the <coughs> the item. Item here. I will store the product. Product model. Um, product model. Will we have the product? New array list. Okay. Uh, this product model I create a, a, the other class for the product model. In here we have three parameters, three attributes, uh, code, name, and description. Description. Okay. And uh, <coughs> now we will create two product, product model, product one. Prop one uh, new okay and in here we have the code zero h zero one and name me product one and for the description a this a good product product okay and okay we have the second product this is two true not good okay and now we are going to the list product add okay Product one, product add, product two, product two. Okay, now we have two product. The just sample in a uh, in the real scenario, we will get the list from the database, something like this, and then we will will uh, append it uh, and gener generate uh, this product into a CSV file. Okay. And now we will create a file file from java.io new file. Okay, we will put the name for the product export CSV, right? Okay, now we will create a Spring Writer for the print writer writer new print writer we put into the parameter file and uh, it is required for the chai cat right chai cat so we will put this into the chai cat cat okay we have a exception 
exception okay and now we will have three tasks here right hitter right party and the final that's okay for us but uh, we need to uh, get the bot of file restore bracket okay so let's write the uh, uh, write hitter first now I will separate into the order method to easy okay a private static why we use static access modifier because uh, in uh, we will use this method into the main method and the main method will static so uh, the method requires a static access modifier okay let's go for <coughs> um right Hitter, okay. In the hitter, we have a list uh, and a return string. String, okay. Uh, we need to the string builder result new string builder, okay. Return resource to train okay and now we will look to the list for the hitter the list uh, string hitter okay now hitter stream for each item we have the item and then the resource a pen item inside and we have a pen the order the limitinator limitator okay eliminator so the limiter is uh, that is separate between two item two item and in here I will create a, a variable for this one uh, private static final string millimeter for comma and I also have the different variable private static final string line separator okay and this one will contain those okay and now we have the pen for the limiter okay and finally when we have the hitter out of the stream for it have a resource dot append append delimiter a line line separator okay and then we return the resource next I will create the right party for the body we I will create a private static frame right body in party we have the list of uh, product okay in here now we also have the string builder and we return result to frame okay now let's use the product dot string 
dot for each okay and <coughs> with our for it we have one item item here and this item we have the result dot append firstly you have item get code and then append item dot get name okay dot append item dot get a uh, description and finally we have a pen uh, a pen what delimiter the limiter okay which for the separate its line and we also have the results dot a pen the in here for the line okay it no don't need here uh, line separator I think we should to a pen for the uh, get code get item uh, you know this delimiter for is line uh, the result we have to append the code we separate this with uh, with the item code the uh, name as well name as well and the description as well Okay, in here, and the last one we will insert a line, line separator. You know why? Because uh, it uh, the the each item we need to separate into the different line. So first item and the second item, the last one will append the line separator. Okay, finally we have the resource. Now let's complete in the header. In the header we have uh, uh no uh, in the writer writer we will write string result for the writer header writer header for the header okay and in the body we have the writer for writer write write what okay right in here we have the right body for the product okay and finally we will print out the part of the file right or get absolute part okay if we have any error we will see out uh, and get message okay now let's run this and track the result now we have the file in the location let's copy this one and go into our folder the PC and paste to this press enter now it's in a writer different file for the product export okay was that's all for this tutorial thank you for watching and please click on the subscribe button to get the new follow in my channel new videos will be coming thank you